in this in this video i do a school q a about questions that you ask me for school like give you guys some advice for school and i really hope you enjoy today's video and let's get on to it hi guys so i'm making a video of a school q a I started school about uh, three weeks ago, but my videos have been delayed a lot because I've been busy with school and with badminton. So I've, I have written a list of questions on here that I am going to be answering today in this video. And these are questions that you guys asked me. and. Um, now I'm going to be answering them in a YouTube video for you guys. So the first question is, what sport do you play? Like I said in the beginning of the video, I play badminton. For This is my third year playing on a team at my school. Second year being on varsity. Um, and because I am a senior, I have to play on varsity or I don't play at all. So, yeah, and then when I was a freshman, I did do basketball. So pretty much every single year, I've done at least one sport. Um, it's just I wanted to do one sport every single year instead of being one of those boring teenagers that doesn't do a sport. So I've done basketball my freshman year, sophomore year through senior year, I've done badminton. And I would have done badminton in freshman year, but I had no idea what it was like or what badminton was. I heard about it, but I don't know what it was. And I didn't think about <laughs> looking it up. So I played um, badminton sophomore year through senior year. The next question is, what is one of your favorite things uh, about high school? One of my favorite things about high school is that I like how I have lunch with my friends and um, they are really amazing. I really like lunchtime because it, that's when I really get to talk to my friends and also another fun, fun thing is getting to know someone who is new to the school or who is struggling and just helping them and um yeah that is what's fun and because i don't normally talk in class we can't talk in class guys because if we talk in class then we're not focused on our work and then the more distracted we will be and then the more chance of failing um the next question is how's school school is doing amazing I have one teacher who gave, who has been giving out a lot of assignments since like the first week of school, and but school is amazing, and um, I have fun classes. I have culinary. I have advanced composition. I have college math. I have um, computer graphics and design. I have a sports and performance class, which is like a weight training class for athletes and I have been so sore from that and also badminton and my legs I'd come home day three or four of doing badminton and that and I'm so sore and I'm walking around and I'm like I can't move and things like that so I've been so sore in that one and I have Spanish which I wanted to take a foreign language class and I wasn't forced to take it, but to get in a good university, you have to take it. But also another thing is that what happens if I do come in contact with someone in, in college who speaks Spanish? Or what happens if I have a teacher who speaks Spanish only? And I have no idea what they're saying. And that's why I want to take it which I don't think there's going to be a teacher who always just speaks Spanish, but you never know what the issue could be. Or I could approach someone or something and don't know what they're saying because they are speaking Spanish. 
the next question is do you have a friend in your class um i think i have a friend at least in a few classes but not really a lot besides like we don't all sit next to each other so that would suck but i would say i like it when there's no friends in the classes and i like it at the same time because sometimes you can be like hey you and me you and me for partners you can when your teacher is like oh partner time partner up with someone you don't know we pretend like we don't know each other and we're like do you want to be partners yeah we want to be partners and sometimes it's a good idea it's a good idea not to have a club friend in the class because that's a chance of meeting someone new and also getting to know someone new and also um a chance for you to focus a lot more in um in class so yeah this next question is is there a lot of people i think this question is saying like is there a lot of people in high school or when High school first started back up there is a lot of people we have like a lot of um, people at our high school and everyone is still social, dis social distancing and staying safe but there is a lot of people who came who were online last year and came to school this year so there's a lot more students uh, than last year <laughs> Um, this next question is, um, is high school fun? High school can be fun in some ways. I would say the only thing that high school could not be fun is when you get bad grades and you can't play a sport. Or when, um, you get assigned a lot of homework and you're just behind in it. And I would say it's fun because you get to try out for sports and you can also um you can also there's dances at, at my school there's dances and there's pep rallies and there's spirit weeks and like clubs lots of clubs and that's how we meet new people and things like that so it could be fun um this next question says online or in real life i would prefer to take school in real life instead of online i would say that my grades did struggle a little bit last year when i was taking finals because i was online and i am bad a bad test taker and i prefer to be in person to take everything um and to ask for help because i understand it and i see the teacher's visual and i understand things a lot better than being online because there's a lot of distractions at home that bothers you so yeah the next question is what is like what is it like being on a sports team um honestly it's really really fun you get to meet new people like you keep saying in the video you keep meeting new people and another thing is that um, you um, try your hardest and also another thing is that um, you put a lot of hard work and dedication in in trying out and being on varsity or being on JV and just meeting new people that's pretty much this like and it's fun because these girls my badminton team every single year we loved it we loved the songs that we played during practice and we laugh all the time so yes it's fun this next question is can you give me a tip for going into high school i would say be yourself you don't have to change your appearance or anything like that just because someone tells you to be yourself be confident in who you are um, try new things like try going into a club that you um, haven't heard about and get to know the club or try out for a sport or anything like that try new things this next question is what grade are you in if you guys didn't know already 
I am a senior in high school. I know I don't look like a senior. I know I don't look 17, but yes, I am a senior and I graduate this year, which is really, really scary. And go watch my first day of senior year. It's just a couple of videos down from this one. It's really fun. So this next question is, what's something you don't like about the school? I don't like that the teachers give out homework and they expect us to know the directions or the rules of how to do it and then they give you back your homework and they give you an F on it because you didn't do it right to their standards and it's like yeah these next question is do you wear face masks to school um I do wear face masks to school I started school without one but then they made us wear a mask so since like the third week of school we've been starting to wear masks to school but it was optional in the beginning of school um and then this last question is do you prefer tests online or in person i prefer tests i don't know really honestly i don't really know i would say both but I'm not really sure. So yeah, so this is it for today's video. If you liked it, give it a big thumbs up. Comment below if you want any more types of Q&A videos and what I should do a Q&A about. Um, follow the YouTube and Instagram it will be on the screen or in the description below. And make sure you follow it because there's a lot of content being put on YouTube on that Instagram account and I'll see you in the next vlog. Bye!